Hello guys, Lovely Jan here. So for today's video, ay pag-uusapan natin ng about sa Health Card. So ito yung website na healthguard.ph. Ano nga ba yung patungkol dito? At kung makikita nyo sa ating screen, ay makikita tayo dito ng parang barcode. So ano ba tong barcode nato? At bakit iting hinahanap ng ating mga frontliners kapag tayo ay pupunta sa market or sa mga establishments dito sa ating municipality? So first, kikilalanin muna natin kung ano tong healthguard.ph. So syempre, punta po tayo sa kanilang website. Type lang natin yung healthcard.ph sa ating browser. So, dito tayo sa FAQ nila. What is Healthcard PH? So, it is a cross-platform software application that runs in multiple operating systems and devices for community-driven approach used as communication channel between an agency and its members in terms of health and safety. So, who built Healthcard PH? HealthCard PH is developed by Business Intelligence Research and Development Center or BIRD and Health Innovation Center or HIC of Isabella State University in partnership with BLDT, Smart and Volunteer Software Engineers from IT Industry. What are the services of HealthCard PH? HealthCard PH is mainly used for generating data analytics to provide agencies insights in providing healthcare services. It can also be used for current global pandemic COVID-19 for contact tracing. So, kilala naman natin yung word na contact tracing. So, ano nga ba tong contact tracing na to? Contact tracing is defined by World Health Organization as a process of identification and follow-up of persons who may have come in contact into contact with a person infected with the contagious diseases to help the contacts to get relevant care and treatment. So, how does HealthGuard BH works for COVID-19 contact tracing? Ganito po ang ginagawa nila. HealthGuard BH works uses community-driven approach by reporting registered health card users using system-generated HG codes as their contacts through text messaging, web application, and mobile application. If one of health card users is identified by concerned healthcare agency as suspected or probable COVID-19 patient, health card application will work with healthcare agency to generate contacts report of health card users to inform the people who had close contact with infected individual to provide appropriate health care. So, malaki talaga ang tulong nitong health card PH. So, this time, pag-aralan na natin kung paan tayo makapag-register. So, how to register using health card web application. So, first, kailangan natin mag-open ng ating browser. So, click natin ito. Then, type lang natin yung health card PH. So, wait natin na mag- uh, pakita yung kanilang interface. So, this time, nandito na tayo sa ating uh, healthcard.ph. All you have to do, pupunta tayo sa account type. Ito check natin kung personal or business. So, kung para sa sarili mo, personal. So, kung may business ka or may agents ka pinatatrabuhan, pwede ito. So, i-click natin. So, limbawa, personal. And then, dito, itatype lang natin yung ating CP number. As you can see, na-type na natin yung ating number. Then, select your address. Select municipality or city. So, Chage. Bawa, Chage. Next, Urup. Next, Barangay. And then, i-check po natin itong agree dito para masabi natin we agree in the terms and conditions. And then, click register. Once na-click niyo yung register, hintayin po ninyong may mag-send na OTP. So, ito. I-enter natin yung marireceive natin mula sa phone natin na OTP dito. Okay. So, ito na. Na-receive na natin yung ating OTP. Yung four numbers sa iba ba, yun yung magiging temporary password ninyo. So, i-enter natin ngayon yun dito. Ating OTP code. So, enter natin yung four number doon. So, once na enter na ninyo yung inyong uh, nakuwang password mula sa text message from HealthCard PH, makupunta kayo ngayon dito sa change password. So, as you can see, meron na tayong code dito. So, 
syempre, palitan muna natin yung password na ibinigay sa atin ng ating sariling password. So, mag-bibigay mag mag tayo yung sarili nating password. Okay. Change tayo. Okay. Then, click change password. So, na-change na natin yung password. So, susubukan natin kung nagawa na nga natin yung ating uh, account dito sa health card PH. So, enter ulit natin yung ating CP number. And then, yung change natin password kanina. Then, click login. Ayan. So, ngayon guys, na-update na natin yung ating password. This time, i-update naman natin yung ating profile. So, update natin. Kailangan natin i-update yung profile para mapangalanan natin at makita dito na uh, milalagay yung health concerns sa atin. So, bawa yung name na gagamitin. First name, and then family name, and then gender. Check natin. Click lang to check, and then mar mar marital status. And then, date of birth. So, type natin. And then, ayan. And then, birth place. Type natin. So, ito kanina na-enter na natin yan. So, okay na yan. Dito tayo sa sasagutan natin. Then, are you a student? No. And then, are you employed? No. Are you health worker? No. Are you pregnant? Kung lalaki, not applicable. Kung baba, it's either yes or no. Next, update sa medical history. So, nandito na yan. What are your pre-existing diseases? So, ikaklik lang ninyo kung anong meron sa inyo. So, for this one, none. Next, which of the following signs and symptoms have you been experiencing? So, pipili tayo dyan. As of now, wala naman. Next, did you visit someone in an area with reported local transmission of COVID-19 during the 14 days prior to onset of your illness? No. Did you have contact to a confirmed probable case of COVID-19 in two days prior to the onset of illness? No. Have you undergone laboratory testing for COVID-19? No. Are you positive for COVID-19? Probably ayan. So, no. Are you positive for real-time reverse transcription? Ayan. Yung mga laborat laboratory terms nila. So, no. Then, after set na yan, guys, pwede na nating i-update yung profile. Okay. Since updated na yung profile, ayan, kukunin na natin na itong code na pwede nating i-print. So, i-screenshot natin siya. Ayan. So, kukunin natin. So, nakopya na natin siya. And then, ipupunta natin sa ating format. Ayan. So, pwede natin pangalanan to para maayos. Tapos lang natin ng health card. Lagyan natin ng name para medyo bongga naman. At hindi tayo nalilito kung kanina ito. So, limbawa yan. ilipat lang natin yung name dito sa itaas para mapangalan. Okay. So, ready. Okay na guys yung code. Ayan. So, pwede na nating i-print itong codes. That's it guys for this video tutorial. So, pwede nyo rin i-log out after nyo ito settings then click log out. So that's it guys for our video tutorial on health card PH on how to register and get your own personal health card code. So para sa mga bago sa aking channel guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more video updates. See you next time.